you're not you're not yamming you're not coming to my yard eating my food yeah taking taking my water out of the fridge running my re taking my my resources yeah I'm not letting a woman come to my yard and take my resources and not free up pum pum because that's the only thing women can offer man the only thing women can offer man is pum pum if there's no pum pum on the table you need to, you need to just spin back and hit your sides there's no point jamming here no more a woman is not going to take my resources and leave me with a stiff one fam mm. is my name mr blue balls is my name johnny i don't think so what is wrong with these broke men broke men that are just so entitled and you don't have anything they are the ones that don't have anything and there's one that are proud you don't you want you don't you won't let anyone to take your resources what resources to be honest when i saw the video i was just laughing i was okay this guy is like a comedian or something so i went to his page he was he's not a comedian that's his mentality that is who he is Hey beautiful people and welcome back again to my youtube channel it's your girl maria davis and i'm back again with another interesting video i have few reactions on this video a lot of people were just you know coming for him okay so let me play the stitches for you to watch then i'll come back at the end of all the stitches my resources yeah i'm not letting a woman come to my yard and take my resources you don't even have bed sheets behind you are the resources in the room with us? Are the toilet papers your pillows? Like, I need to see the resources you are so hot and bothered about. Get the will, get the will out. He doesn't want anyone taking his toilet papers. Recorded all this on a Nintendo DS. It's crazy. Fact, do not ask me to bring you something on the way. Cause any of you, any- Now, before we get into the topic, first of all, First things first, shout out to my man for finally changing his t-shirt. That shit needed to be done. We know that. that shout outs to you. You've come a long way, fam. Secondly, so let me get this straight. Is this message for just the single mothers or for women in general? I, I, I just want to know. The funny thing is, yeah, there's certain men like this that will literally prey on single mothers because they think... Because they have a child, they're worth a lot less and they don't have to try as much, do you know what I'm saying? Everybody has their own dating requirements and standards, do you know what I'm saying? So, if you're a man that doesn't date single mothers and stuff like that, yo, that's you, I completely understand. Do what you're doing, do you know what I'm saying? But man, <laughs> just be careful, do you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying, boy. But shout outs to you for changing it to t-shirt. That is just a bad man, bad man flex. I'm not letting a woman come to my yard and take my resources. I'm not free up pump pump. Sir, I don't know if you noticed, but it doesn't look like you have many resources. You clearly have nowhere to sit. You're sitting on the floor. Your mattress doesn't have a sheet, a top sheet, a pillow, a pillow case, oh a blanket. What resources are you referring to? And why is your toilet paper on your bed? Like, make it make sense. It's always the people with no gold calling women gold diggers. Like, what? You're not, you're not yamming. You're not coming to my yard, eating my food. This is how you know things have gone too far. There is no way a man is sitting in front of a mattress with no sheets on it and some toilet paper. And he's complaining about resources. I mean, bro, you don't have no resources. You need to go back to the drawing board. There's no resources around. We are not dealing with this. Get off of the internet. No woman wants you. Hit a, yo, your mattress didn't even fit the, fit the box spring. God damn it. Excuse me for cursing. That doesn't even make any sense, guys. Do not get on this internet, start talking about you don't want some woman or man taking your resources. You don't got no resources. Most of y'all broke. Now, this guy extra broke. You don't even have sheets. Yeah, I'm not letting a woman come to my yard and take my resources. In the background of the video is a box spring with a mattress on top of it, slightly askew. No fitted sheet, no top sheet, no comforter. <laughs> No blanket, no nothing. No bed frame. Um, a six pack of one ply toilet paper. <laughs> what resources are we talking I about? Don't know. I don't know. You notice it's never the men that look like they would be with Lori Harvey that are complaining about um, gold diggers and women using them for resources. It's always somebody. 
who looks like they own nothing but debt and a sample of Dior Sauvage. <laughs> Woman come to my yard and take my resources and not free up Pum Pum, cause that's the only- Excuse me. Oh my God. Is that a dollar store multi-pack of toilet tissue? Are you using that as a pillow? <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of dollar store, you know you can get food items for a dollar, right? Have you been tossing it up for food? Who convinced you that uh, food is worth fucking over? Like you were just, not because you wanted to, but because you were hungry. And you, you would throw ass. <laughs> you can for a dollar twenty-five get a name brand Chef Boyardee. The name brand, can of spaghetti and meatballs. That's a whole meal for $1.25. And if you don't have a job and if you don't have money, there's food banks. They will give you food. And you don't have to throw it back. Hit me up. I'll give you all the info you need. <laughs> what is this with this broke man? What is their problem? They are always the ones that are always against men paying full money on first dates. You see them saying, no, I have to go 50-50. It cannot come to the day, so you have to go 50-50. They're always the one attacking women. They're always the one angry. Like, I don't know. <laughs> he said he cannot just allow a woman to come and come and take his resources just because she's offering him a pum pum. So he's saying that his resources and a pum pum they are not on the same level because <clears throat> he's not going to just collect pum pum why it gives her the resources she has to do more than giving him a pum pum <laughs> see i found this video very funny i don't know <laughs> to be honest when i saw it i was laughing i was thinking probably it's a joke or something but it's not and his stitches were so much and almost everybody was saying the same thing that's why i just brought out a few ones almost everybody was insulting the way his bed was the toilet like the bare minimum it does it can't even afford the bare minimum you can't even put your room together you can't even have a proper bed and you're talking about a woman coming in to take your resources see it is always this type of men that are always angry when they see a man taking care of a woman they are already, they are angry they are upset i remember the interview about <clears throat> the guy that is always on the street asking questions when he asked this man and the lady was like how much did you buy at this ring and he told her, i think it was ten thousand fifty thousand i can't remember it was like a very huge money and he was like asking the girl what did you do to him after he bought you something like this like these broke men they cannot understand why would you spend so much for a woman why would you appreciate a woman so much why would you take care of a woman so much if she's not your slave because they are poor i feel like it's because they are poor mentality they can't understand how those men do it so you can't even take care of yourself you don't even you're not even supposed to have a girlfriend because i don't think any girl should stoop so low and take you as their boyfriend because you cannot be my boyfriend i'll come to your house and your bed is like that <laughs> i don't understand like can you even take care of yourself like what resources do you have what is she going coming to take from you that you are protecting and you're trying to say that your a pum pum does not want your resources so apparently his page if you go down when i went down his page i was just seeing him he was, to, to be honest that guy doesn't like women at all and he's always attacking women you know especially single women he will tell you that do not accept there's a video he even did he was like telling men that don't take care of a single mother and don't date any single mother let them go back to their baby daddies blah 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 blah, blah. even if he wants to take care of them leave their child alone blah. like he just talks like it's not okay like he's mentally not okay 
but apparently most of these men are like this <laughs> i can't understand the resources he's talking about anyway but let me know your thoughts about this video that conversation is a short video so i had to share with you all today so thank you so much for sticking around to this point i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to like and share and subscribe and put your thoughts about this video down in the comment section and i'll see you all in my next one bye